Welcome to RenewEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. Hello and welcome back to the RenewEnergy.com YouTube channel, where we ignite your curiosity about renewable energy and sustainable solutions. Today, we're diving into a truly electrifying topic, the diverse world of hydrogen fuel cells. Fuel cells are at the forefront of the renewable energy revolution, providing clean and efficient power across a multitude of applications, from powering your smartphones to entire power plants. But did you know there's not just one, but many types of fuel cells, each with unique characteristics, applications, and innovations? In this video, we will navigate through the fascinating landscape of fuel cells, including alkaline, solid oxide, molten carbonate, phosphoric acid, direct methanol, solid acid, regenerative, and even microbial fuel cells. We'll uncover their historical background, explore their operating conditions, delve into their reliability, and so much more. Whether you're an energy enthusiast, an industry professional, or simply curious about the future of clean energy, this is a journey you won't want to miss. So buckle up and get ready to explore the remarkable world of hydrogen fuel cells with us. Don't forget to hit that like button if you find this topic interesting, and subscribe to our channel to stay updated on all things renewable energy. Now, let's get started. Introduction the global shift towards cleaner and more sustainable energy sources has sparked interest and innovation across various technologies. One such technology that has been steadily gaining attention is hydrogen fuel cells. This introduction provides a broad overview of what hydrogen fuel cells are and why they're increasingly essential in the realm of renewable energy. Overview of Hydrogen Fuel Cells Hydrogen fuel cells are devices that convert the chemical energy stored in hydrogen into electricity through a chemical reaction with oxygen. Unlike conventional combustion-based technologies, fuel cells are highly efficient and can operate without emitting harmful pollutants. The basic structure of a fuel cell consists of an anode, a cathode, and an electrolyte membrane. Hydrogen is fed to the anode, and oxygen, or air, is supplied to the cathode. Through a series of reactions, electrons are freed from the hydrogen molecules and travel through an external circuit, generating electricity, with water and heat as the only byproducts. There are several types of hydrogen fuel cells, each with its own unique characteristics, materials, and applications. From transportation to large-scale power generation, these fuel cells are adapted to various needs and requirements. Importance in Renewable Energy Hydrogen fuel cells are not merely a novel technological advancement, they represent a critical step towards a sustainable energy future. Here's why they are important. Clean energy, Unlike fossil fuels, hydrogen fuel cells produce electricity without emitting greenhouse gases or other harmful pollutants. The only byproducts are water and heat. Efficiency Fuel cells can be more energy efficient than traditional combustion engines, making better use of available fuel and resources. Versatility With different types catering to various applications, hydrogen fuel cells can be implemented in cars, buses, industrial machinery, and even large power plants. Integration with renewables, hydrogen can be produced using renewable energy sources like solar and wind, creating a green hydrogen economy that aligns with global climate goals. Energy security, by diversifying the energy mix and reducing dependence on fossil fuels, hydrogen fuel cells contribute to greater energy resilience and security. In conclusion, hydrogen fuel cells are more than just an alternative to traditional energy sources. They symbolize a convergence of innovation, efficiency, and environmental stewardship. As technology advances and economies of scale are realized, hydrogen fuel cells may play an even more pivotal role in shaping a sustainable and clean energy landscape. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into the various types of hydrogen fuel cells and explore their unique characteristics and applications in the following sections. Proton Exchange Membrane Fuel Cells PEMP. Proton Exchange Membrane Fuel Cells, or PEMCs, are one of the most widely recognized and utilized types of hydrogen fuel cells. They have found applications in various domains, ranging from automotive to portable power systems, thanks to their unique attributes. Let's explore their applications, efficiency, and working mechanism. Applications and Efficiency Automotive Industry PEMCs are particularly popular in the transportation sector, being used in fuel cell electric vehicles, FCEVs, such as cars, buses, and even trucks. Their quick startup times and ability to operate at lower temperatures make them suitable for mobile applications. Portable power systems, beyond vehicles, PEMCs are used in portable electronic devices like laptops, mobile phones, and emergency power backups. 
Their compact design and efficient energy conversion enable prolonged battery life and reliability. Distributed generation. In some cases, PEMPs are deployed for decentralized power generation, providing electricity to remote areas or off-grid locations. Their modular nature allows for scalability. Efficiency. PEMPs typically operate at around 40% to 60% efficiency, depending on the load and operating conditions. This efficiency can be even higher when the waste heat is captured and used, as in combined heat and power CHP, systems. How it works PEMPs consist of a proton exchange membrane, often made of a material called nafion, sandwiched between two catalyst-coated electrodes, anode and cathode. Here's how the process unfolds. Hydrogen ingestion At the anode, hydrogen gas is introduced, where it encounters a catalyst, usually platinum that breaks the hydrogen molecules into protons and electrons. Proton transport. The protons travel through the proton exchange membrane to the cathode, while the electrons are forced to travel through an external circuit, creating an electric current. Oxygen reaction. At the cathode, oxygen, from the air, reacts with the protons and electrons, forming water as the only byproduct. Heat generation. The reaction also generates heat, which can be used in some applications or must be managed through cooling systems. PEMP's ability to operate at relatively low temperatures, around 80 degrees Celsius, and their quick startup times make them a preferred choice for dynamic applications. However, they are sensitive to fuel impurities and require high-quality hydrogen, as well as careful water management within the cell. Solid Oxide Fuel Cells SOFC. Solid Oxide Fuel Cells SOFCs, are a class of fuel cells that have gained recognition for their ability to operate at high temperatures and utilize a diverse array of fuels. Their versatility and unique characteristics make them suitable for various applications, particularly in stationary power generation. Here, we'll delve into the aspects of operating temperatures and fuel versatility of SOFCs. Operating Temperatures High temperature operation, unlike some other types of fuel cells, SOFCs operate at considerably high temperatures, typically between 800 degrees Celsius and 1000 degrees Celsius. This elevated temperature has both benefits and challenges. Efficiency, the high operating temperature allows for increased electrical efficiency, often exceeding 60%, and can reach up to 85% when used in combined heat and power, CHP, systems. Materials, the extreme temperatures require the use of specialized materials that can withstand the heat, such as ceramic electrolytes and specific metal alloys for interconnects. Thermal management, ensuring uniform temperature distribution and controlling thermal expansion are vital for the longevity and performance of the SOF. Startup time, the high operating temperature also means that SOFCs have a relatively slow startup time, which can be a limitation in applications requiring rapid response. Fuel versatility. Diverse fuel options. One of the standout features of SOFCs is their ability to operate on a wide variety of fuels. This versatility stems from the high operating temperatures and the use of a solid oxide or ceramic electrolyte. Hydrogen. Just like other fuel cells, SOFCs can use pure hydrogen as a fuel, making them a part of the green energy landscape. Natural gas. SOFCs can also use natural gas, either directly or through a reforming process that extracts hydrogen biogas and syngas, they can operate on renewable biogas or synthetic gases produced from coal or biomass, adding to their ecological appeal. Fuel flexibility benefits, this ability to utilize various fuels provides flexibility in sourcing and application, allowing integration into different energy systems and compatibility with existing infrastructure. Alkaline fuel cells, AFC. Historical background. Alkaline fuel cells, AFCs, are among the earliest types of fuel cells, with development dating back to the 1960s. They were even used in NASA's Apollo missions, providing power for spacecraft. Development, early research focused on optimizing the performance and reducing the costs associated with AFCs. Space exploration, their utilization in space missions showcased the potential of AFCs in providing reliable and efficient power. Reliability, AFCs are known for their reliability and robustness. Efficiency, AFCs typically operate at efficiencies around 60% to 70%, making them among the most efficient fuel cells. Durability, their stable performance and resistance to degradation contribute to their reputation for reliability. Molten carbonate fuel cells, MCFC. Large-scale applications. 
MCFCs are designed for large-scale, industrial applications. Power Plants Many MCFCs are used in power plants to provide electricity to the grid, utilizing both fossil fuels and renewables. Combined Heat and Power They are also used in CHP systems, capturing waste heat for additional efficiency. Operating Conditions MCFCs operate at high temperatures, similar to SOFCs, typically around 600 degrees Celsius to 700 degrees Celsius. Fuel flexibility, like SOFCs, MCFCs can run on various fuels, including natural gas, biogas, and coal-derived gas. Materials and maintenance, their operating conditions require specialized materials and regular maintenance to ensure performance and longevity. Phosphoric Acid Fuel Cells, PAFC Industrial Applications PFCs are primarily used in industrial and commercial settings. On-site generation, they provide on-site power generation for facilities like hospitals, hotels, and factories. Reliability, PFCs offer stable and reliable power, an essential feature for industrial applications. Characteristics PFCs have several defining characteristics. Temperature, operating temperatures are typically around 150 degrees Celsius to 220 degrees Celsius. Efficiency, they offer moderate efficiency, usually between 40% and 50%. Direct methanol fuel cells, DMFC. Portable power applications. DMFCs are particularly suited for small, portable applications. Mobile devices, they are used in mobile phones, laptops, and other portable electronics. Military applications, DMFCs are employed in military technology, providing portable power in remote locations. Methanol as fuel. The use of methanol as a direct fuel is a unique feature of DMFCs. Fuel storage, methanol is easier to store and transport compared to hydrogen, making it convenient for portable applications. Lower efficiency, however, DMFCs usually operate at lower efficiencies, around 20% to 30%. Solid Acid Fuel Cells, SAFC Lower Temperature Operations SAFCs operate at lower temperatures, typically between 200 degrees Celsius and 300 degrees Celsius. Versatility, this makes them versatile and suitable for various applications, including residential and small-scale commercial power. Composition SAFCs use a solid acid material as the electrolyte. Material advantages, these materials offer benefits like stability and compatibility with various fuels. Regenerative fuel cells, RFC. Renewable energy systems. RFCs are unique in their ability to operate both as fuel cells and electrolyzers. Energy storage, they can be used to store renewable energy, making them an integral part of renewable energy systems. Dual modes of operation. RFCs operate in two modes. Fuel cell mode. In this mode, they generate electricity like other fuel cells. Electrolyzer mode, they can reverse the process, storing energy by producing hydrogen through electrolysis. Microbial fuel cells, MFC. Biotechnological applications. MFCs utilize bacteria to generate electricity. Wastewater treatment, they are used in wastewater treatment plants to both treat the water and generate power. Use of bacteria. The use of bacteria in MFCs is a defining feature. Energy conversion, bacteria break down organic material, freeing electrons that are then captured to produce electricity. Sustainability, MFCs represent a sustainable approach to energy generation, utilizing waste materials as fuel. And there you have it, a comprehensive exploration of the incredible world of hydrogen fuel cells. From the historical significance of alkaline fuel cells to the biotechnological innovations in microbial fuel cells, we've journeyed through a landscape rich with diversity, potential, and sustainable solutions. These fuel cells, each with their unique characteristics and applications, are not just a part of the renewable energy spectrum, they represent a bridge to a cleaner, greener future. A future where energy is not only abundant, but also responsible, efficient, and harmonious with our environment. We hope this overview has ignited your curiosity and given you insights into the many ways fuel cells are shaping our energy landscape. Whether it's portable power, large-scale applications, or even harnessing the power of bacteria, the world of hydrogen fuel cells is as vast as it is exciting. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey. 
If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to our channel for more content on renewable energy and sustainability. Feel free to leave a comment below with your thoughts or questions, and we'll do our best to engage with you. Together, we are powering the future, one cell at a time. See you in the next video, and until then, stay energized. Thank you for choosing RenewEnergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, visit us at RenewEnergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.